Boy, oh boy. It's crazy shit right here, man. Assalamu alaikum. Shalom. My God Hotel. What's good with it, peeps? What's good with it? Fuck with your boy. It's your boy Azakar, man. You already know. Like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. You will be notified every time I drop videos. You just hit that bell. You should get a notification if you are subscribed. Yo. <laughs> I got two little articles for you, man. Shit crazy out here. You know what I'm saying? People are just doing what it is. COVID-19. 2020. All fucked up. It's all fucked up. You hear me? Make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe. Yeah, man. We're going to talk about this. There's some crazy shit right here. This is some crazy, crazy, crazy. Check your boy out right here. <laughs> Yo, Dunkin' Donuts, uh, Dunkin' Donuts employee arrested after cop finds large, thick piece of mucus in his coffee. Ugh. 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 A Dunkin' Donuts employee has been arrested after the police officer found a large, thick piece of mucus, which was later confirmed to be saliva in his coffee. The incident occurred approximately 10:20. On July 30th, when the Illinois State Police District Chicago Trooper bought a large black coffee from the Dunkin' Donuts establishment located on the Archer Avenue in Chicago, Illinois. <laughs> Chicago, a motherfucker boy. <laughs> Due to the coffee being extremely hot, the trooper removed the lid from the top to cool it down. <laughs> oh, man, that's fucked up. The Illinois State Police said in the statement, right? Did you, oh God, it took the top off, Lord. And it was then in that the officer noticed mucus and saliva floating inside his coffee cup. Oh God. <sighs> Vincent J. Sessler. That's the man name was taken into custody. <laughs> oh, Goodness, and been charged with disorderly conduct and battery to a peace officer. And the officer found mucus in his coffee at a Dunkin' Donuts. Mm -mm -mm. So fucked up. The ISP immediately began an investigation into the incident, which uh, culminated just a couple of hours later after the arrest of the 25 year old Dunkin' Donuts employee, Vincent J. Sessler. My boy, that's, that wasn't too smart to do some shit like that. You know the, uh, the them boys in blue, if you ain't about that life and you ain't got no brotherhood behind you that's going to go hard like they going to go, leave it alone, buddy. Leave it alone. Oh, man, this is crazy right here. Florida man clings onto the hood of a big rig truck. Driver said he lost it. <laughs> it's crazy, motherfuckers, man. Look at this shit, man. He can't make this shit up. <laughs> oh, man. Well, they got more insight on the story from my from what I'm understanding. And the man put himself on the hood of his his own violation, excuse me, volition, and started causing the ruckus for no reason. The driver, Edward Hughes, tell TMZ, this dude hopped onto the interstate, bloodied and frantic, waiting for the truck to stop. Which Hughes said he did. Once he did that, Hughes claimed the guy latched onto his hood and started using a mental object on his windshield. What the fuck? The motherfuckers got the T virus? What the fuck is going on? Hughes say he panicked and hit the gas trying to shake the man off as he was successful breaking through the glass. God damn. Dude, this some old Terminator shit. Sir O'Connor. <laughs> what the fuck? He's got some shots of the damage, and it looks like the fella was hacking 
uh, uh, away during the mayhem and broke through the, a bit too. Goodness gracious. God damn. He broke through that man's shit. Look at that. You see the pedal? Boy, that's some fuck shit. Mm-mm-mm. They were told Hughes eventually got a hold of the cops and they finally pulled him over and took the man into question into custody. It's unclear what he might have been wrong with him. Shit, that motherfucker was on some T-Virus. That's what the fuck was wrong with him. He was on some bullshit. God damn. Florida man strike again. Only this time he's in action hero mode, which looks way more terrifying in real life than it does on big screen. God damn. Oh, shit. So we got some audio and video of this shit. Check it out, y'all. Florida be like, what the fuck? Look at that motherfucker, you see him? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Motherfucker boy, he gonna skin his goddamn ass, and all that, all that weight behind him, man. That nigga's crazy. That nigga crazy, man. I'm gonna leave links in the description box on that one, but that's some fuck shit. <laughs> oh, you can't. Oh man, you can't. Oh my god. I ain't got no producers, uh, uh, producer studio. You can't make this shit up. <laughs> you can't write a script for this shit, boy. God damn. God damn. But hey, like this video, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. You will be notified. Peace and the ball of hackers, people. Mm.